Glossaries allow you to create and maintain a list of definitions, similar to a dictionary. To add a glossary to your course, navigate to the section you wish to add your glossary to and select Add an activity or resource. Select Glossary. Select Add. Name your glossary. Add a description to your glossary if required. You have the option to make your glossary global. Global glossaries are available throughout the Moodle site. From the Glossary Type drop-down menu, select either Main Glossary or Secondary Glossary. You can only have one main glossary per course. The Glossary system will allow you to export entries from the Secondary Glossary into the main glossary of the course. You have the option to approve all glossary entries by default. Alternatively, you can change this setting to ensure that trainers approve all glossary entries. Always allow editing. Controls whether or not a learner can continue to make changes to their glossary entry. When no is selected, learners are only able to make changes to the entry for a particular time period. Select whether you wish to allow duplicate entries and comments on entries. You also have the option to automatically link glossary entries. Select your preferred display format. You can configure the appearance of your glossary as required. Should you wish to set a passing grade for the glossary, you can do so here. Should you wish to associate activity completion or a conditional activity to the glossary, you can do so here. There are further customization settings available, which you can use as required. Once you're happy with the settings you have selected, select Save and Return to Course. Your glossary now appears on your course page. Select the glossary. You can now begin adding entries to your glossary. Enter in the concept name. Enter in your definition. Add any relevant keywords and attachments. Should you wish to allow auto linking, select it here. Once you're happy with your entry, select Save Changes. Your entry now appears within the glossary.